In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to look up PMS colors in Photoshop. So I have uh, my first amazing logo right here, and um, ideally you should get the exact PMS colors from a company. If, if you're using their logo, they should have a style guide for you. If not, that's something that they should really have because your logo, it's, it's the core marketing piece for your business. So you want to make sure that people aren't using the wrong colors or altering your logo. So it's, it's very important to be exact. Um, this, this is more, um, well, it's just, I'm just going to show you how, how to look up the colors here. So I have all these different colors on here. Well, I guess three different colors. So if I want to know what shade of blue this is, I'm going to go up to the eyedropper tool right here. Uh, or hit I, uh, that's the shortcut, and I'm going to click on the blue. And you can see the blue pops up right here in this little box here. So now I'm going to double click on the box and it goes to our color picker. Um, but that doesn't do me much good because all of this stuff doesn't really mean anything to me at all. So the way I find the PMS color is I click on color libraries and it shows uh, the Pantone. You can select which one. I just usually use uh, Pantone Solid Coated. Um, and it'll show um, the selected color and uh, and the PMS color here. So I see that it's Pantone 285. So what I can do is I can name this Blue 285, just so I remember. Um, now well, what's the screen color then? So I'm going to click on the green, double click on the box here. There we go. Click on color libraries. Oh, well, it's uh, it's 368. So we're going to call this green 368. And that's just a handy way, you know, um, to, to remember what the, the different colors are. So you don't have to keep going back and doing that. Um, so now, you know, this looks pretty cool with the blue text here, but I wonder what it would look like if we changed it to green. You know, maybe, maybe you're designing this logo for a client and let me tell you, don't create it in Photoshop. It should be created in Illustrator so you can have the vector art. Uh, this is just, um, just for the, the sole purpose of showing you how to look up colors. Um, so uh, let's go up to our uh, character tab here, and so we can see that it's in the blue 285. But let's see what this what this looks like in green 368. So you can click here and either click on this, or if you want to, if you have a specific color, click on color libraries. And so that's that's the blue that's coming up. But we know we want to use 368. So just type it with your um, you know your number pad here so 368 there we go and it just takes you right to it click OK and that's how it looks we can undo redo undo so I prefer the blue but that's just me so that is how you can set and look up PMS colors in Photoshop so I hope this tutorial was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, please. I put out lots of uh, video tutorials. And always let me know if there's something you would like for me to do a video on. Uh, also, check out my blog at sallyu.com. Thanks for tuning in, and I hope you have a great day.